Okay, to those who are addicted to old series stuff, remember this? Let's get started! So I got th that clip from the old 1960s Batman series, which was played by um, Adam West and as Batman, Bruce Wayne and Burt Ward as Dick Gordon or Robin. So it was aired in the Philippines when I was, during my elementary days. Proceed to the tutorial. Okay. Okay, guys, let me show you my output. So here's my output. Okay. That one. Okay. So again, let me repeat that one. Okay. So now I will, sh I will be showing you how I made it. Okay. So let's try to make a new project called or Control Alt N. And don't say. Okay. Let's make it. Let's make a new composition, Control N, and we will just do the 1920 beta 80 p and then let's make a title, Batman Transition. Okay, so press OK. Here we go. And let's get some clips from my video. This one and my transparent logo. Okay. Let's just put that. Let's wait. All right. So it's supporting, and my transparent logo. So before that, let's make a solid. So right click, new, and then solid. Okay. And this one, I'll just use this color, whatever color you want. It's up to you guys. I'm just showing you my, how I made it. My methods doing this video okay. so next is I'll just grab my footage here and let me remove the music for you okay let's remove the music and okay so next Let's rotate the, the footage, the video. Okay, so let's rotate it. Okay. So let's go to transform. Press this one and click this icon under the rotation. Okay. Time vary stopwatch. You call it time vary stopwatch icon. Okay, so here rotation. So this will be the first footage. Let's try to zoom this thing. Next one is so on the, on the second frame. Frame number two. Let's try to use this rotation. Okay. Next is the other one here. Maybe the other side. one is the other side and okay let's try all right so let's add a motion blur so click this one in, so that it could enable a motion blur for all layers on this video. Uh, this. So let's add. This. Let's click this one and then look for this one. Motion blur. This box. Just check it. So let's see. Look. Wow. As you can see, it just rotated once. So let's rotate the video endlessly. So now we will type here loop 
out and then add open and close parentheses and then click anywhere okay so let's see how it works all right okay oops so So look at him go! <laughs> wow! <laughs> look at him go! <laughs> okay. Look at him go! <laughs> so there you have it. Ah, uh, let me save this. Let me save this first, okay? Okay, next is... So, we are done with rotating the video endlessly. So... Okay. So, the rotation is endless. Uh, All right, so let's try to add some image, okay? So here, let's drag the image, my image, all right? And next, so now, let's click transform and let's go to scale. Okay, scale, so let's decrease the size of it. Next is... Zoom it. Oh, sorry. Wrong. Zoom it a bit. And. Alright. Let's try. Okay. So for my first so the first position so the first scaling of the um, of the of my vector image is I you uh, I uh, use number uh, 54.0 and then on the next one is I zoom it for about 89 percent scaling and next part so I make it more bigger so I use 120 percent and then till it gets back to its original form where it starts so okay 53.0 so it's a bit smaller from the beginning okay so all right <laughs> so let's highlight these time frames and right click and keyframe assistant easy is in all right so So, there you have it. Okay, that's all for today. So, thank you for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And please click on the bell button for you to be notified with my new uploads. Okay, guys. This is Rafi and see you next time. Ready?